Okay, I'm booting up my Pi Mac. I've got RetroPie installed. It was very easy to set up. You know, hats off to the guys at RetroPie. They've done a really good job. It's really slick. It's very nice. Okay. And here's the boot process. I'm going to lay this up against a piece of 2x4, so it may not look all that great, or I may not get it all. I don't know. But anyhow. Um, okay, hope you can see that. Here's my controller. I got a 8 bit do, you know, NES 30 Bluetooth controller. It's very slick. I'm going to turn it on. And it should be connected. Okay. Uh, I know the recording's not going to do the, the image any justice, but this looks really sharp. Um, I don't care what anyone says. Uh, you know, VG, um, sorry, CRT images uh, have a much richer color, deeper color. It's very nice. It's a great interface. I like this, you know, this theme. Let's play a Nintendo game. Super Mario Brothers. Of course. I like this controller, it's very responsive, it's very nice. I just updated the firmware I had to. Let me see if I could still do this. And I failed. I wanted to go back and go into the, uh, down the tunnel there. But that's alright. You guys get the picture. So then I can exit the game, select start. And I can navigate around. In ports right now I have Kodi installed, but I can uh, I can install things like Doom and you know like um, you know a desktop environment. And I got a Super Nintendo game. I've got Street Fighter Alpha 2 and Sonic the Hedgehog. Let me just start this up. Looks nice. I want you guys to hear, you know, the the Sega. I hope they got picked up on my phone. I'm not sure if it did. There's Sonic. Alright, this thing is pretty much done. I mean, I still need to do a couple of things, but for the most part, it's usable. I can start playing.